Hi guys, PD here. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to another new video. This is Experience Color Blindness. It's a new app. It's just appeared on the Oculus Store. Hi, I'm QB. Nice to meet you. Hello, QB. Now, as you can gather, this app is designed to make you experience what it's like to be color blind. I don't know anything about it. I've not seen any trailers or anything, so this is all new to me. Okay, we've got options here. Hand skin color, I'll leave everything alone. Okay, select mode, full experience, scene garden or scene shop, scene museum, paint, something, atelier. Okay, we've got a color buying test as well. So I'm going to do the um, colorblind test first, just to make sure I'm not colorblind. I don't think I am. So let's try out this same um, colorblind test first. In this test, I'll show you various plates with different dots, and you'll need to tell me what you see using your laser pointer. Even if you have perfect vision, there will be plates with nothing in it. Press the button to begin. Okay. This is a really nice environment. I do feel quite tall. I feel a bit taller than I should be, but looks really nice graphically. Very well, let's begin. 12, eight, six, 29, 57, five, three, 15, 74, 2, 6, 97, this is getting really hard now, 45, 5, 7, 16, 73, uh, I don't see anything on that one, nothing. Nothing again. Nothing. Nothing. 26. 42. 35. This is really in depth. I've seen these um, color charts before, but I've never seen one as in depth as this one. 96. Okay, nothing. One line, two lines. I can see one line. Two lines, I think. Two lines, there's no lines there. Okay, is that a trick question? I'm gonna put nothing. Um, I can see lines, but... I don't understand the line part. I can see lines. Okay, there we go. I can see one on there. One again. And I can see that one. It appears you have perfect color vision. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Return to the hub. And let's check out the full experience. This world looks really, really cool with the floating blocks. Full experience. Let's talk about color blindness. The color we see is determined by wavelength of incoming photons. Our eyes use three types of cones to determine color, one sensitive to short wavelength, another for medium, and third for long. However, not everyone's that lucky. Some people have one type damaged, often too close to another, or even completely missing. Have you noticed how your world changed? Let me show you more. Okay, I'm in a garden. Got a nice sunset. 
Let's begin with Deuteranomaly, where the medium wavelength cone is damaged. Okay, it's difficult yes. to tell green from red. You can change the intensity from your wristband as well as continue to next anomaly. Okay, my touch controller just vibrated there. That guy reminds me of somebody. It's the robot from um, First Contact, or is it? Um, is it the robot from the film? Well, what's the film called? I forgot. Johnny Five is alive. Short circuit. Okay, so this is teaching me about different vision anomalies. Oh, it said to activate my wrist. Okay, intensity. So I can change the intensity. Okay, that's perfect color now for me. So a colorblind person will see the world like this. It's very hard to distinguish the colors now. I can see like yellows and blues. Those flowers over there, like a dark yellow, a bright yellow, a whitish color. So let's um, continue. Protonomaly is very similar to the previous one, except now the long wavelength is closer to the medium. Red-green colors are faded together, except now pure red is barely visible. Once again, use your wristband to continue. Okay, this is really interesting. I don't think we appreciate seeing color. For people with normal vision. Tritonomaly is quite different from the previous two. As it changes the short wavelength, you will have trouble telling blue and yellow from each other. Once yes. again, use your wristband to continue. Everything's red. I'll turn that down. So we've got normal colors now, we've got purples there. What color are those buildings there? Okay, so they are red. Cone monochromacy is when there is no difference between cones, so you can see only one color. It is very rare with less than 1 in 100,000 people affected. Some people don't have any cones and their vision depends only on rods. In addition to no color, it's also very difficult to see in the daylight, as you can see right now. Yes, that's awful. Let me take you to the shop to try shopping fruits. Okay. Let's try shopping fruits. Eight types of fruit will spawn in front of you and I'll tell you which one to buy. You need to pick the correct one and place it into the shopping basket. Let's try it with Deuteranopia. Okay. Three, two, one. Lemon. Oh, lemon. So I'm having to buy the fruit based on its shape because these are all yellow. That one? Tangerine, please. Tangerine, I'm guessing this one. Tangerine. Tangerine. Give me tangerine. That one. Tangerine, oh, please. Two. It's wrong. That's wrong as well. Tangerine. Alright, the tangerines are small ones, so I need this one. Lime, please. Lime. That one. Now I'm wrong again. Give me a lemon. That's a lemon. Give me lime. Okay, so lime is... Which one's lime? That's not lime, is it? Is that one the lime? Lime. 
Uh, we're not doing so well now, are we? Lemon. Okay, I'm looking at the textures Tangerine, now. Tangerine, please. Tangerine, small one again. That's um. Give me like tangerine. Let's continue to museum to adore art. Okay, onwards we go. Here is the end of our journey. A museum where you can adore various forms of arts. You can now fully control your color blindness from your wristband. Also, you can teleport here. Press right thumbstick and then point at your desired teleport marker and you'll get there. Okay. Shove on around. Okay, these pictures are really, really colourful. Let me head back over here. Let's have a look at this um, sculpture here. And I can play around with the different colour blindness. So what was that? I knocked all the um, barriers over there. Okay, I think that's about it then. This is uh, really interesting. So we return back to the hub. I'm quickly going to have a look at the different modes. Test FM. Advanced test for color vision deficiencies. Let's check out the advanced Here test. Here you can see four rows of objects in different colors, perfectly yes. sorted. When you are ready, I'll shuffle the rows and you'll need to sort them again. Press the button to begin. Very well, let's begin. Okay. The first and last object is immovable and in correct position. You can move the other objects with your laser pointers. When you are done, press the button on the right. Okay guys, there you go. I'll leave it there. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please leave a like and subscribe. Be sure to hit my little bell and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye robot. Okay, so now I need to arrange all these different colors. So you grab them and move them. Very interesting. So this is all about getting the shades right.